What's up everybody? Welcome to another video. Today I'll be unboxing the Galaxy 2 Mega Minx and I am super hyped for this video because I've been wanting to try this puzzle out for myself for the longest time since it came out. Yeah, so today I'll be unboxing it. So the box is quite huge actually, but it's super super cool to see how professional the boxes have become. Alright, so in the box... Wow! Did seriously that happen? So they actually have uh, this little box in their cubes, just like the Valk has and the other cubes and what's in here? The little, oh, so cute. Okay, so I've heard of these. So basically these are extra caps that you can, you can replace the cream color with these black caps, just to make it more, um, I mean, recognizable. But in my opinion, I won't do that because I really love the cream color on the Mega Minx. Also in this box, we have, let's see, a little Mega Minx pamphlet and uh, there is quite a bit of information in here. Wow. I guess this is the full tutorial on how to solve the Mega Minx. Oh my god. Yo, there is a lot of stuff here. Um, oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. So there is basically a crap ton of Alex. So let's, let's, not, let's not bother with the pamphlet anymore. Let's get right in to the Galaxy 2 Mega Minx. The Galaxy version 2, it is way smaller than the version 1 and the edge length is only 30.5mm. The version 2 is also way lighter than the Galaxy Mega Minx, weighing only 136 grams. So internal mechanism has also been upgraded, resulting in a glorious 40 degrees forwards corner cutting and backwards corner cutting can also reach an unheard amount among other Mega Minxes around 25 degrees. So the corners have also been modified to a point that the main issue with the corners twisting on the version 1 has almost disappeared. Alright, to begin with, it is a little greasy from the outside. I mean, that's alright, that means it's lubed, but <laughs> it is so small. It is so cute, like look at this. And look at this fat, fat monster, like I can barely hold it with one hand. But this one, oh, so cute. Okay, so we'll see if that's a good thing or not, because the Wii one is, it has this problem. But other than that, I, yeah, the Wii one is really good. So let's, let's see if the Wii two is just as good. So the first turns. Oh, wow. So these are just the first turns. And it, it turns more smoothly than the V1. Alright, so... Just listen to how quiet it is. Like, oh wow. So yeah, it's, it's, it's amazing. Okay, now I can, okay, so I can definitely tell the difference between these two and the Wii one is definitely more slower But it's actually more comfortable for, okay, yeah, this is, this is quite small I mean, I'll, I will give it like a few solves, but maybe like a few averages and I will come back to it when I'm done Because now it's actually uh, fastening up It is very, it's, oh yeah, it's fast, <laughs> it's really fast like, like really fast, okay. Uh, but I'll do a couple of averages and I'll come back. So what's up, it's me, and a week later after the unboxing and I've done over a hundred solves on this Mega Minx and I have got to admit it, it is way better than the version 1. I'm not going to say that it is going to be your main the day you will unbox it, but 
In like 30 or 40 solves, you will feel the difference. I have broken all the PBs on this Megaminx and I am st I'm still improving. So, the only con with this Megaminx, the only defect, defect, I mean, is it is it is so small that sometimes in the last layer when I'm spam spamming the TPS sometimes the back face turns randomly just because of the uh, size and I I'm sure that this is going to change after a hundred solves because I will get just I will just get used to the size but still yeah it's kind of stupid in the first first 10 20 solves that the back layer sometimes moves but you will get over it so other than that I've had only like three corner twists and on the version one I, I have like two every solve so it's an amazing improvement uh, from X-Men and I have got to recom recommend you to buy this queue and um, as you can see <laughs> uh, yeah I got a sub 120 solve so uh, the cubicle please sponsor me like why you haven't yet and <laughs> okay just kidding so here you can see the difference between the version 2 and version 1 and as you can see the version 1 just looks like the 3x3 sale the, the big sale and it just looks super super cheap the version 1 comparing it to the version 2 because the version 2 looks so so smart so so polished and it just looks amazing so um, in my eyes in my opinion the version 2 is an amazing Megamix and you should buy it so maybe in like a few months I will try to magnetize it we'll see how that goes uh, but there is still no no point of magnetizing because it's just very very good